Here's meteorologist TJ Del Santo with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. So we still haven't gotten above freezing yet today, TJ. Are we going to make it there or what? I don't think so. We might uh, flirt with the freezing mark. Yeah. We may get up another degree, maybe up to 32, but we're not expecting much in no. the way of melting today at all. Let's take a look at what's going on right now. Live City Camp picture, beautiful day, barely a cloud in the sky. I don't think there are any clouds in the sky there. Looking at uh, blue skies, 28 degrees with a wind chill factor of 19. That's what it feels like outside, courtesy of a wind from the north at 10. Live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar is quiet because there's nothing out there in the sky. Beach Cam, down there in Narragansett, a pretty blue sky down there as well with gentle waves crashing on the shoreline, 26 degrees. Wind from the east-northeast right now at 8 miles an hour. Coventry, 27. The morning low. It was really cold earlier in the morning, down to 11. Caitlin Rice saying it's chilly. She's got sunshine, though, 24 degrees over there in Warwick. Generally 20s everywhere across uh, southeastern New England at this noontime. 25 in Smithfield, 28 in Westerly over in southeastern Mass, mid to upper 20s with a 27 degree temperature reading over there in Taunton. Your weather headlines, quiet weather today, tomorrow and into the daytime on Thursday and then milder weather will return but the price we pay for it is some uh, wet weather a little bit further down the road and we're still watching for the potential for a weekend mix. At least one of the days will feature some rain and some snow. Salad radar picture showing lots of clouds, a lot of ocean clouds off to our south and east, much like the uh, lake effect snow showers. These are ocean effect snow showers. I actually had some flurries across the Cape earlier in the day. The rest of this, this is not cloud cover. This is actually snow cover across New York and Pennsylvania. You can see the Adirondack Forest up there and the White Mountains of New Hampshire covered in some snow, especially some of the higher peaks. High pressure is in control, giving us lots of sunshine. We're going to keep that through the afternoon and we're going to keep it into the daytime tomorrow as well with high pressure right overhead. A little bit of wind that we have today is actually going to be diminishing to uh, fairly quiet conditions for your Wednesday and a bit of a warm up tomorrow as well, a small one. Upper 20s this afternoon on the east side. Pawtucket, Central Falls around 28 degrees, taking on over into Cranston and Warwick. Temperatures should be topping out similarly in the upper 20s to lower 30s. 31 degrees in Warwick, maybe cracking the freezing mark along the south shore in spots. 32 in Westerly, 31 in Charlestown, Newport about 32 degrees. Cold and dry up in northern Rhode Island, upper 20s in Boroughville, 30 in Situate, Johnston and Cumberland. Sunny and dry with uh, temperatures kind of cold. Upper 20s and low 30s over in southeastern Massachusetts as well. But with these winds from the northwest, 5 to 15 miles an hour, these temperatures will feel a lot colder, likely in the teens at times. Now this evening it'll be clear and cold with temperatures falling back through the 20s. Sunset time almost at 5.30. We're getting there. Here's your live pinpoint Doppler 12 seven-day future cast. Looking at sunshine for Wednesday, 35 degrees after another cold start to the day. And we are looking at uh, temperatures to be uh, warming up to about 41 degrees come uh, Thursday with dry weather. Looking at some rain on Friday, about 44 degrees. And then on Saturday, we'll be drying out about 39. And then we're looking at a potential for a, a rain-snow mix on Sunday. And that should be out of here for Monday. Sunshine about uh, 43 degrees. So just a little bit below average in terms of temperatures for the next couple of days. And you can get your updated future cast on the Pinpoint Weather Station. It's on Cox Digital Cable Channel 125. So bundle up the next uh, couple of days. Small warm-up tomorrow, but still below average. All right. Thank you, TJ. Thanks, TJ. Now